and welcome to this new unturned update of 3.14.5.0 so yeah let's get into the video so hi guys welcome to this video today all this new stuff has been added uh, but the new thing I wanted to change because not many people have been doing this I know a few people have if you go to play into a single player world now it's got a new description type of thing in like all the maps like um, it's really cool like some of the maps won't have them because you know they're new you got them from the workshop so yeah let's get back let's get into the world with all the stuff so guys we're in the world my new little world thingy my house um i built you know it's just a, a basic world you know um but yeah basically i'm going to be showing all the new stuff in this little house we've got a little chest storage room i don't know why it opens like that it makes no sense but i like it so anyway first of all i want to say as well first i forgot to make i didn't forget to make this video For some reason my internet has been down so that's why there's been no videos this week i've i believe i've got one i've got about two i've got one day to basically make three videos so i'm going to be making some loads of unturned videos like the ones you've probably already seen but i haven't really had much time to make this because my internet's only come back today but first of all i guess we're going to look at the new uh let's look at the new vest see this is the civilian vest um you could probably find this around you know um it's a really cool vest it looks cool it is quite cool i remember this used to be in the old unturned i believe i think there used to be a civilian vest i remember it used to look like this but as we've got a new vest i might as well show you the like the there we chuck you down we pick this stuff up because we need this um let's go into the spec ops like outfit let's put all this on i'm probably going to be dropping a lot of stuff but just look how cool this looks guys like especially this looks so cool like it says jtf2 on the side i believe it's like a bomb squad or something in canada um but i could be wrong there but i'm pretty sure that's what it is i i don't know but yeah look at this it just looks so cool this like really does look good i like this like especially like, holding a gun like it is really cool um but yeah um let's get holding the new stuff like you can chuck all this down because we don't need the old military stuff like now we've got all this stuff here uh so now I guess we can go into the diving gear, like the diving gear is really cool, uh, so we've got the new diving gear here, put it on, uh, where's the tank, there it is, uh, so yeah this is the diving gear I believe, I don't know if there's, I've missed anything out, I should probably have a thingy but I'm not sure, so basically this will allow you to like go underwater for longer time, um, I will show you at the end of the video because I'm going to be heading over to the water soon. But yeah, and also guys, we've got this new duffel bag. Like, this is really cool, I think, because look, just look at it. It goes behind your back. Like, it like, has a little thing around the front and it goes behind your back. Um, and yeah, this is really cool. I believe this has a, quite a lot of space in. Um, I don't know. Yeah, this is like the second biggest bag. This, the Spec Ops outfit. Then I believe this is. I don't know. If this is a big bag, but it's still quite big. Uh, so let's just chuck a load of this stuff on the floor. We need that. Where is that gone? There it is. The oxygen tank. We don't need the duffel bag. Um, I guess we're gonna take. Our, oh yeah, the chart. We've. We got I need to pick all this stuff up because I don't know where it's all gone. There it is. Um throw this stuff down so we don't need this. Uh we got the makeshift armor here as well. I don't believe I don't think I showed you guys this. This is like really cool. You can make this with I believe a uh, three bits of leather and five scrap metal bits. Um you know so you could just blow up a car, kill an animal and you know you have one of these. Uh, you need your crafting level to be up by one, I believe, to use make that. 
so let's come over here now we've got this new G chart and GPS so if I throw it on the floor and then click the map this will come up no chart found so you're not gonna know where you are um, like no GPS found so say you go to like a place and you find a chart you can now I believe use the chart uh, I think I've got it. Yeah, I've got it in my inventory. I don't know why it's not letting me show you guys it. Oh, there we go. We've got the GPS. Uh, I don't believe the chart works on the map I'm on. But yeah, the GPS allows you basically to look around like the old map, you know, like to see from like the sky view, like all the trees, the military base and the military base. And basically the chart, I don't know why it's not working. I'll put a picture on the screen now of what it looks like. Um, so yeah, now you guys know what this looks like, I mean, right, so now I guess I'm going to head over to the water, so I will speed this bit up, going from now. Guys, we're at this, like, container thing, and I forgot to show you the scythe. This is a new, like, weapon, I guess, you can find it at a farm, you can, like, hold it two hands. Uh, it's really cool, you can, like, swing, like, it's a really good weapon, I think it takes the zombies out in, like, two hits or something. And it's really fast at swinging, so you could probably kill a few zombies with this. I believe this is, like, one of the powerful weapons in the game. Now, so there's a few kills with the scythe, you can, like, hit it pretty fast. Um, but that's not what I wanted to come here to show you, um, I love this map by the way, um, but basically now with the new diving gear we can swim underwater for a long time, and if you're wondering how, uh, we, this, the, this, there we go, put you on, how this and this connects, if we look at the description of this, um, there you go, it's connected by Wi-Fi, um, by Wi-Fi, um, I don't know how that works, but I thought that was quite funny, uh, so I'm going to show you guys that, yeah, we got a few boats, oh, talking about boats, I forgot to show you guys the police boat in the last video, so, oh, magically you make that appear, 3, 2, 1, alright, so I've got the police vehicle down there, but uh, now I said before as we've got the new diving stuff so I'm going to jump down and see how long we can sort of stay under there so you can see our diving lake it, the water thingy goes down really slow I guess you can swim around with this for a long time like underwater you know you can make a base probably um, the only problem is if you are going to make a base there's not much room to take stuff down but I think if you had a friend who could just throw you the stuff down you could build some really cool bases underwater I really want to see some PvP bases underwater but we've also got this new police boat I forgot to show you guys you know it's really cool it's just a police boat it's just a, basically a boat but it's a police boat um, I forgot to show you guys this in the last update, but I, forgot, I guess I didn't realise it was added to the game. I should have realised, but I didn't, so I'm sorry about that. But I also want to show you the new stuff you can do in the water. Now you can use a gun in the water. Uh, so this is really cool. Um, you never used to be able to use guns or stuff in the water, but I believe you can like hold stuff in the water as well. Say we make you free, you can eat stuff in water as well, you can, no, you can like, say if you're swimming across, someone's shooting at you, you can just pull your gun out and shoot at them. But yeah, that's really cool that you can do that. Um, but, there's also something I wanted to show you with the maple strike. Um, I believe it's called the, no, the eagle fire, I'm sorry. Um, I don't know why I called it that. Basically now when you shoot... I don't know if you can see that, but little white flashes come across, it's easier to see at night, so I'll change it to night, um, like, uh, hold on, there you go, you can kind of see that, um, if I try and go out like this, you'll be able to see it a lot better, there you go, So that's quite cool, um, I'm going to need to get myself a, a new magazine, I believe, for the gun, I believe it's like 17 or something, so I'll give myself that really quick, 
I, actually, I'll make it day first. Um, now I give myself that. There we go. Um, I don't know, I should have probably... I've got this new camo on my gun, if you guys don't know. Basically, you can get camos um, by, like, earning them. I think I... Um, I don't know how I got this camo. I didn't have it, like, before, but now, for some reason, I've got it. I didn't know I had it. But I must have unboxed it or something a long time ago. But, um, now, basically, with this, the... Uh, what is it? The um, Eagle Fire. No one really liked to use this gun, because, like, it could only go on semi... And not like auto, but now you can put it on burst. That will allow you to shoot like three three bullets at a time. Um, so yeah, this is going to be a really cool weapon. I mean, I know I'm going to give this weapon a lot more like of a chance now. I guess I never used to use it, but now I believe like now with this free burst, people are going to use this a lot more of this weapon. Um, like I love this weapon. Uh, but if you want, say, you want the it not to be like the lights on the gun. I guess you don't want to see them lights. All you're gonna need to get is a military muzz, like a muzz or something. And and now you can see uh, there is no lines coming through the gun. That's because I don't know why, but it just basically stops the gun light from showing I guess oh, we got some zombies coming for us we just headshot him but yeah that's pretty much the end of this update I know there was a lot of stuff in this update and a lot of the last update I forgot to add the police boat so anyway guys thank you for watching this like new update thingy uh, remember to tell me if there's anything I forgot as well as all the IDs and stuff will be in the description or on the screen as I use the stuff but yeah, anyway, bye guys.